Welcome to Dance to Heal. I'm your host, Jenny C. Cohen. Join me as I share stories of how dance and movement can bring healing in a way that is safe and tailored to your life. I'm a cancer survivor, mother of two, and an award-winning performer who found that movement was vital to my recovery. I created Dance to Heal Wellness and also authored the best-selling book, Outside in Recovery, Dancing My Way Back to Myself After Breast Cancer. I will bring new techniques to help you on your dance journey and healing path. Are you ready to move? Dance to Heal starts now. Darlene Green is a retired Navy commander with over 26 years of experience in executive leadership and senior management positions across diverse industries. Darlene's passion is helping people activate their stem cells by elevating their GHQCU, repairing their DNA, reversing their aging, and getting out of pain through the latest photobiomodulation technology. So listen, folks, you are so lucky. You are in such a, for such a treat. Darlene, thank you for coming today. Oh, Jenny, it's so awesome to be here with you. Yeah. Yeah. And audience, um, on my YouTube, you can see my hairs up. Usually it's down. It's down for all of my interviews. And Darlene scheduled this awesome podcast time at a day where I am so busy. I'm running back and forth and back and forth. And again, apologies again, Darlene. I was late logging on for my own podcast to record, folks, because I am kind of overbooked and trying to fit so many things in. And I really think this is an apropos topic today about taking charge of your health. Darlene, tell us why you started doing this, even though you were, you're like basically ex-military, who I love, by the way. And so like, <laughs> what got you into this path? Thank you, uh, Jenny. So, right. You know, when I, when I was in the Navy, so I did 20 years in the Navy, a retired Navy commander. I had my own health issues. I had some autoimmune disorders, fibromyalgia, chronic fatigue syndrome, POTS, postural orthostatic tachycardia. So I've always had an interest in health. But truly, my interest in the ability to activate your own stem cells did not come until my husband's diagnosis of early Alzheimer's. When that happened, we went out of country. Uh, we went out of country four times in a year at high expense to uh, get IV stem cell, stem cell injections. Uh, nothing really changed. Him. Like it didn't make a difference. Uh, we tried hyperbaric chamber. We did hyperbaric chamber three times a, a week for a month. I actually think that made him a little worse. Uh, we, we certainly revamped the diet. We cleaned up everything, no alcohol, no soda, no sugar, no white flour, no genetically modified products, uh, very clean grass fed, grass finished proteins, right? Um, a very high quality fats only. So we, we certainly cleaned all that up. Still weren't seeing any difference, extra exercise, high intensity training, leg training, trainer with a, tra you know, all of that. Um, new sleep protocol, very high intensity effort to try to get him into deeper sleep. Nothing was making a difference. Um, so when I had a friend say to me, we are try we have tried something that has changed our life. This has transformed our lives. Try this. It's not putting somebody else's stem cells into you. It's activating your own, which are dormant. I did not know when you're 30, half of your stem cells are dormant. And when you're 60, almost all of them are dormant. They're floating around in there. They're just not doing anything for you. And so I'm 58. And I was like, wow, I could use some activated stem cells, right? We all could. Um, and, and so could my husband, certainly. He needed all the help that he can get. Because by the time we got to this place where they were introduced to me, he was not himself anymore, Jenny. He was a shell of him of himself. He was napping three and a half hours a day, falling asleep about seven at night. We were going to bed at 8.30, you know, to get to sleep by nine. He was disengaged from conversations. They were just too challenging for him. Um, he would, if he did engage in conversation, it was like he was three conversations behind. Uh, he'd ask the same questions over and over, like, like anybody with Alzheimer's, um, you know, like seven times in three minutes. Um, but the thing that broke my heart really was, core to his personality is him being funny. And he was just no longer even trying to be funny. So this was tough. Um, well, so we started this patch. It's a non-transdermal patch. It is 
using the same technology of like when you go outside and your body gets the signal from the sun to make vitamin D, um, it's, you know, light therapy has been around 5,000 years. We've known about it. There's lots of people going into infrared saunas, which we've also done, by the way, we have an infrared sauna, um, but you have light inside of you. So what this patch does is it reflects your light back into you at a very specific wavelength that elevates your GHK CU. And that's a copper peptide. It's probably the most profound peptide in your body. We'll talk a little bit more about that and what it does later. But let me tell you what happened for Jim. In the very first week of being on this patch, he didn't nap at all. That three and a half hour nap that he'd done for a year just didn't happen. And it didn't happen and it didn't happen and it still doesn't happen. Uh, he did not fall asleep at 7 p.m. at night. He was so chatty. It was like a dam broke and he had two years worth of things to say all in a week. Uh, he was funny again. He was flirty again. He was himself again. And he was with it. His conversation was with it. It was more appropriate. He was replying quickly. I, I It was just mind blowing. Um, the second week he recorded the best deep sleep we've ever had, where it had been 15 minutes, despite all of our efforts, he was now, he got an hour and 25 minutes of deep sleep. And then, yeah. And then at two and a half months, uh, he regained the ability to whistle. That's a huge neuro thing. And he regained the ability to drum to the beat and, oh, and his blood pressure dropped 37 points. He had had 172 over 94, his blood pressure dropped 37 points. And then at the five month mark on the patches, he had um, he had lost his sense of smell 15 years ago, and I didn't know I didn't know then what I know now, which is sense of smell and losing your sense of smell is actually an early warning indicator for Alzheimer's. So if it's not related to COVID or something else, you know, get that checked out. So he had lost his sense of smell. We hadn't thought anything of it, but after five months on the patches, he regained his sense of smell, and that that doesn't include like. His bald spot closed in and hair grew back and it came in chestnut brown. I have all of these. I have a broccoli forest of hair standing up. It won't lie down because it's like baby hair and it's just growing like crazy. So we, I want to, I want to make sure people understand we have a long way to go. My husband is not healed and I have to be really careful to make sure it's clear that the LifeWay products are not intended to cure, treat, diagnose, or prevent disease, even if they do. Um, that that's not what they're intended to do, but we, we have experienced phenomenal results, not only with him, but also with me. So, you know, my story, I, I was depressed and I will tell you, it took me a few years to finally actually have it all sink in. My husband has Alzheimer's, uh, uh, you know, and, and, and that was sad, but it was really when I broke my foot, sprained my ankle. I was sitting in a chair to, I had to ask for a glass of water. And when I did, he would just look at me like, I don't even know where to begin to do whatever you're asking me to do. And getting a glass of water was too hard. So I was devastated and thinking, this is my life now. And, and I was so I was depressed. I was in pain from my foot. I was having to take a medicine that increased my blood pressure, flew to cortisol to keep from passing out. Yeah. Um, I had regular headaches. I had a pretty severe case of rosacea and had for years. The dermatologist couldn't seem to get rid of it. Um, I had very dry skin that I was like lathering up with Cetaphil. I, I would travel with a tub of Cetaphil, be, the cream, not like a lotion that was not thick enough. Like I needed the, the heavy duty stuff. I couldn't lose weight. I was in the postmenopausal state of like not able to lose weight. And no matter, I mean, I have people say you're not eating enough. And I'm like, why can't I lose weight? Right. It's probably hormone imbalances or whatever. And I will admit to being a stress eater. We don't have any crap in the house because we got all of that out the door, but I could eat a whole bag of pistachios. <laughs> like, you know, it's, you know, nuts are my thing. I love them. And so what happened is after patching, first of all, ice wave is the best thing since sliced bread. It is the patches that get you out of pain. And it took my pain away immediately. And it took my pain away better than Percocet, Vicodin, morphine, nothing works like ice wave. And I love that it's not, there's no drug in it. There's no drug and you can get pain free in 15 seconds. Um, I love that. I didn't have regular headaches. I stopped passing out. I no longer have to take fludrocortisol to elevate my blood pressure. My rosacea cleared up now, not overnight. It took three months. Um, cellular regeneration and healing doesn't happen overnight. We didn't get into this state overnight. We're not going to get out of it overnight, right? But my rosacea cleared up. Um, I actually had a brown spot on my face, like a sunspot that just, it, it just faded away. 
Um, my pores got smaller. My skin got so, so soft. I, I will even say it's as soft as a baby's butt, <laughs> like that soft. It's just, cr- I constantly am finding myself like rubbing my elbows, which used to be crackly and, and dry. And they're just soft. And I lost 10 pounds effortlessly. Um, you know, I was no longer stress eating. That helps. But there are um, studies that show that our patches can actually help you increase muscle mass and reduce body fat uh, and increase bone density. And, and that happened for me. In addition to not, you know, not having um, as many body aches, but the perhaps the best thing was my depression lifted. It just, it just dissipated. Um, and it's so so much easier to be patient with a loved one that you're caring for um, when you're not depressed, when you're not irritated, and when your anxiety level has decreased. And elevating your GHKCU, you know, GHKCU has been proven in studies for 50 years. This is not a new thing. And you can Google in PubMed GHK, and you can see all the studies. Dr. Lauren Picard has done a ton of studies. And when you Google it, you'll find that Elevating your GHK actually increases your stem cells and produces growth factors. Um, in fact, it protects lungs. It restores lungs to their healthy um, function. It's an antioxidant. It's an anti-inflammatory. It does amazing things for the brains and ner- for the brain and nerves, including um, altering the expression of human genes. It uh, it induces a strong anti-anxiety and anti-aggression. It induces anti-pain. Uh, And then it's got anti-cancer benefits near and dear to your heart, Jenny. It topped 1309 bioactive compounds, which are recommended for the treatment of colon cancer. And it reset programmed cell death of human cancer cells, including human neuroblastoma, uh, leukemia, and breast cancer cells. But it did not affect the healthy cells. It inhibited NFKBP65, which is believed to promote cancer. And it repaired damaged DNA and it reset 84 genes to their growth or cancer inhibition state. So that's huge. Then of course, there's all sorts of studies on GHKCU for hair and loose skin, um, improving fine lines, smoothing and reducing photo damage and increasing hair growth. Um, a lot of uh, a lot of people would get GHK in creams or topical, or they would get GHK in injections. And this one doctor said she was doing four injections a day and not getting the elevation of GHK that this patch does in 24 hours. It's known to accelerate wound healing um, and healing, not just in the skin, but stomach, intestines, lining, bone tissues. I have a ton of friends that very bad gut issues, including my sister who had six years of microscopic colitis Mm -hmm. and she had IV stem cells. She did steroids. She did antibiotics, everything, nothing worked. And in three weeks on these patches, her microscopic colitis cleared up. And then of course there's the um, the improvement on the heart. So it reduces fibrinogen synthesis, which is the top predictor of cardiovascular disease. And it increases myostatin, which inhibits heart failure. So, I mean, there's a, there's a doctor who's a 40 year doctor. He's an anesthesiologist. He said, this is the most significant medical breakthrough in my lifetime. It's the, it's just the most amazing patch. I said a lot there. <laughs> Ask a question. <laughs> Oftentimes when I am personally vested in sharing about something I'm excited, I can't stop talking about it. And for our audio audience, I literally was making faces, touching my elbows, pointing at the spot on my face that I cover up with, cover up all the time because, you know, it's just back from when I was raising my twins and I never took care of my skin because I was chasing two babies around the house and also outside. And I think what's pivotal about, and please audience, please go back and re-listen to everything Darlene just shared with you. It was a lot of stories about people who have had benefit from this little patch that I think the public, we're always the last to know about something. And Darlene's mission is to make sure we know about it, how this developing, right? I mean, before I hit the record button, folks, we were talking about Darlene being able to maybe come to Salt Lake and us doing a part two this, to this interview because there's a headquarters being built here in this area and we wanna do one live on site, right? and for me what comes to mind every time you're talking about all the friends and family that have benefited from is i'm like all right so 
my having had breast cancer, it's not a contraindication to try this, right? Um, and then I'm thinking about my mom, because my mom is older. She's on a plethora of medications I know nothing about. You know, cholesterol medications. Um, she's been on this anti-clotting medication for over 20 years to the point they can't do operations half the time because her vessels are so brittle from being on this anticoagulant, right? And so I'm like, well, I want to get this for her, but how do I know it's safe without her doctor going, well, the technology, you know, the, the research hasn't been done. It literally yeah. is basically everything I've wanted to try after my breast cancer. Well, we haven't done enough research, so you shouldn't do it. How do we That's what you handle do. audience members, case, right? In this, in this case, you have, you have over 90 clinical trials, uh, not, over 90 clinical studies that you can look at. You can see the science of GHKCU. It's been around 50 years. Um, the, this is so safe and there are so, there are no contraindications because there's no medicine. There's nothing going in your skin except light. In fact, in the 2008 Olympics, over 300 Olympic athletes were wearing life wave patches and you know, they're not going to put anything in their body that isn't going to help their enhance their performance and improve their recovery, right? There was a, um, a podcast not that long ago in September where Ivory Sully was talking. Ivory Sully is a five time NFL outstanding special team player of the year. Uh, football player. And he was talking about how he has been on the patches and how much of a difference he's seen and how lots of elite athletes are on, including Tom Brady, um, because people are finding that being able to, uh, well, first of all, let me talk about two studies, one for your mom, one, because of the heart, the heart, um, is they did a study at the center for biofield sciences. And what they found in this six week study is that participants saw improvements in their vascular system. And part of that, the cardiovascular system, they found that every six weeks, the cardiovascular system started functioning as if it were eight weeks younger, eight weeks younger and healthier. You know, they did a brain study in 2019, SciTech uh, study with Chavier, Chevalier. And what they found is they did three EEGs. The first EEG was before they started the patch. And there was just red sphere and the red was um inflammation it was a, a hot brain it's it's uh anxiety it's ptsd it's adhd it's a non it's hyper coherence it's not communicating properly it's like an la traffic jam yeah. so not not working very well in in three weeks time they did another eeg and in session two what they found was the color balance began to change. The yellows, the greens, the blues started coming in. The color just changed entirely. And people were reporting, I'm feeling so much better. I'm feeling so much calmer. I'm able to focus better. And in six weeks, they found a, to a totally new picture of all of the right colors. Uh, and, and the study actually states, yes, it increased GHKCU. Yes, it supported cell and nerve regeneration. Can I just tell you how much I want that for my husband's brain? Yes, it balanced the brain, it improved coherence, it improved the nervous system, it lowered anxiety, it decreased brain inflammation, it improved memory, it improved focus, it improved cognitive brain function, and it improved task processing and speed. In fact, they found that the harder and more complex the task, the more improvement they saw. And, and when I can, I mean, I can cite these studies and say, this is a study from 2019, but better than that, I can tell you, I saw this in my husband. I saw his whole brain light up. I felt this myself. I experienced the, lo the lowering of anxiety and the lifting of mood and the improvement of memory. I mean, that is worth so much, whether you're old or young, sometimes we have those moments of who, what's their last name? And why can't I remember that? And people people begin to experience results from this in three to six weeks. And when, when you think about having to reset these genes and experiencing rapid pain relief, reduced inflammation, which is the root of so much evil, the mm -hmm. wound support, energy and vitality, energy. Let me just tell you, not only did he like have this increased energy and wasn't napping all day. I was in the kitchen cooking. I'm in the kitchen cooking going, I don't know why I hated cooking so much. I, I hated cooking. I've always hated cooking. Um, and I realized it's because I just didn't have the energy at the end of the day to do it. Um, when I did have the energy, like this little energizer bunny, and it just never dipped. And I didn't find myself looking for something to pick me up in the middle of the day. It was, it was fine. And it was great. 
Um, more, you, we talked about mental clarity, but it also enhances sports performance, which is obvious. That's why the Olympic athletes are wearing it. Faster recovery from exercise, which is huge for me because of fibromyalgia. I don't, I don't recover very easily from a hard workout and you and your dancing team, you guys work hard and you, and you, you really need that recovery. And this promotes that recovery in addition to um, obviously improving the the skin appearance, but in 24 hours, resetting 3000 to 4,000 genes to a healthier state. And you heard some of those were cancer, anti-cancer genes Mm -hmm. or all the things that protect. I mean, that's, that's huge. And, and there isn't any, um, there isn't any contraindication. So you can do this with any medicine. In fact, the, the medicines that you talk about, like the cholesterol or blood pressure medicines, one of the things people that start these patches find out is they need to go make sure that they're tracking because they start having to wean themselves off of these medicines because it's, they don't need them anymore. Um, they, they literally don't need the, like my husband's blood pressure. Like if he would have been on a medicine, he would need to come off that blood pressure medicine, right? Cholesterol dropping. People don't need to be on the cholesterol medicines anymore. So they really, and, and thyroid, my, um, uh, doctor friend started the patches and she was taking a thyroid supplement. She doesn't have to take her thyroid supplement anymore. So there's just a, you know, the website actually has those studies. You can go to my website, I am reverseaging.com and you can dig in and you can read all the 90 clinical studies like I did. You can read the patents on how it works. You can see doctors who have incorporated it into their practice talking about how they have. In fact, one of the doctors uh, who's been, he's an internationally renowned doctor, Dr. Um, Shiner, Adam Shiner. He, uh, he's a plastic surgeon. He was featured on the Dr. Oz show. He's featured on the doctors. He actually asks his clients, uh, patients to start X39 three months before surgery and stay on it six months later because he's finding, uh, at least 40% rapid, more rapid speed of recovery and healing as a result. And they look, they're just looking so much better. This doctor, speaking of heart and your mom, he wrote a book called How to Reverse Aging, A Comprehensive Guide to Copper Peptides. This is all about that copper peptide that elevates your and activates your stem cells. Dr. John Harmon, he um, he had a right branch bundle blockage. And there's nothing you can do for that, according to a cardiologist. There's no medicine. There's no surgery. Well, guess what? After 14 months on the patches, they went and did another another test. He didn't have it anymore. It was gone. Three different cardiologists said, that's not possible. Like, I don't know how that happened. Mm-hmm. So it, it's really just, there's a reason this is exploding, but I'm just, I'm talking to you today and to lots of people today, because where was this two years ago when I needed it? Where was this? I didn't know anything about it. I did a lot of research um, and it's not being discussed. I, I actually found out later, two of my doctors are on it now, but, but, you know, not the Bonner Alzheimer's clinic, like, you know, so now I know, but, but I didn't then. And I wish I would have had my husband on it then because we've, we've made advances in areas and not in others, but we, we have a long way to go, but we would, we would definitely be in a very different place if we would have started it two years ago. Um, The company has exploded in the last four years since X39 came out because this little sleeve of 30 patches that you wear 12 hours on, and then you take it off and you throw it away or put it on a pet. Um, you wear it 12 hours and you take it off, wear 12 hours, take it off. Um, you know, it is magical. And it's not that there's not a little life left in it there. It's a probably got 18 hours of life in it. Um, but you don't want your body to get used to the signal and stop responding. And that's why you, you only wear 12 hours and it's more effective if you actually limit it to just 12 hours. But this little, this little sleeve you can get for $99 for a one month supply, which is way cheaper than the $10,000 IV treatment that I got in Mexico, right? And it's your own stem cells that you're activating through the ge- elevation of the GHKCU. It's completely safe, non transdermal. It's like, you know, going out and eating a salad or getting a little sunshine and raising your vitamin D. It's just phenomenal. That's amazing. That's amazing. So, folks, go to Darlene's website. Tell her I sent you (laughs) so she knows how effective being on my podcast is. I'm serious, y'all. Remember to do that. Tell her you came from me, Jenny Cohen from Dance to Heal, because here's the key. We're at this precipice of knowledge of health that we were never privy to, right? I remember growing up and my mom's 
epitome of of dream of me would be that I would be a doctor so I could tell her everything about what's going on I could be her pharmaceutical because she liked to also self-medicate sorry mom but that's true and like she would get she would pester doctors they don't do that now I promise but back in the past to give her like like penicillin that she was just decided she wanted to take here's the caveat though right my mom was on to something in some strange, bizarre, non-educated way. We oftentimes can have access to health through ourselves. I do this through unconscious work with the Evolved Neuro Linguistic Programming. Darlene is presenting something for you that is exponentially inexpensive compared to working one-on-one -on -one with me. Like seriously, I think coupled, it actually is really important. Maybe I'll include this as part of my my elite client you get some of this for free from me oh darling i gotta talk to you about that because i think what's gonna happen is we want health for people beyond what you're even capable of imagining that's what's gonna happen in 2024 you know um there's just so much happening around the world and the only way to help we gotta start with you me ourselves and darlene's process and my process is giving you some ways out so make sure you go to danceandheal.com and you get access to my classes oh and i also started something folks if you've been on my instagram you get to do live dancing with me every sunday at 9 15 a.m mountain time you can come into my my um zoom class darlene's busy at her um Pilates class. Otherwise, I would be like, you gotta log on so we can do some dancing and we'll see her husband running around the background, like waving at us because yeah. others do that. You know, I have pets galore that go through. And then what we'll do is also make sure that you go to Darlene's website. Tell them again what it is. It's I A M I am reverse R E V E R S E aging a-g-i-n-g dot com i am reverse aging dot com yes yes tell them i sent you jenny c cohen i also will post my affiliate link underneath in this episode okay and then once you see this episode please go to the comments and ask darlene any other questions you have I yeah, mean, they can reach out to me there. They can reach out to me and send an email. They can buy the product there. Um, they can um, explore a video on each one of the different products. I actually recommend two products right up for everyone. There's Perfect. nobody that doesn't have inflammation. Everybody has inflammation. And so the first thing you always start with is X39. This is the patch. Like if you did nothing else, you always do this one. But if you can... So this one is like $99 and in the package in the brand new introductory kits, this one is $49 and they both have 30 patches in them. And the reason would be because inflammation eats up stem cells. So if you don't reduce your inflammation, even though you're maybe elevating your GHKCU, which is activating those stem cells, then they're just getting it eaten up by inflammation. So by reducing inflammation and elevating GHKCU, which is activating those stem cells, you're having an opportunity to really have them go to work for you. So those are the two, and you can get two X39 and two Eon in a package of $299. Um, you can also, if you're in pain, you want to get the ice wave. So you could do two X39, one S, one Eon and one ice wave. You know, there's a, there's a ton of patches. Those would be what I would start with for anybody and everyone, unless there were really specific needs. And, but you can ask me, I, I, I can not only provide a consultation, but Jenny, any of the clients that come from your podcast, I, if they would like to talk with a doctor, we can have a special Zoom call where they can do a consultation with a doctor and I will set that up for them. Oh, that's exciting. Yeah. Like most times you can't even get into a doctor without insurance because it's so much money out of pocket, right? So yeah. do that, do that now, like just do that. And then uh, Darlene, may, you're going to come to Salt Lake when that new facility opens up. Gonna, I probably am. I'm going to try. I, the only thing that might prevent me would be travel without my husband, right? Travel. My husband can't really travel anymore. It's too yep. disruptive. We've discovered. Um, so we'll just, I'm going to try. I would love to, and I, I will be trying. Let me put it that way. Yeah. Yeah. And here's the thing. Where are you call, uh, zooming in from Darlene? Chandler, Chandler, Arizona. Not that far. Yes, so I was just there. So Darlene, we'll have to do another follow up interview, promise folks, because I want to tell you what happened when I tried it. Right, that's the key thing because um, I rarely 
you know, actually, I never, I never endorse something that I haven't tried before. And the only reason why Darlene's on this is because I was so enthralled by our initial meeting that I want to make sure the audience, because I'm all about sharing knowledge, there's no need to hoard this stuff. We have to get the world to, at a better place. That's really important. We're at, at, we're at this time where we have to take it. We, no one's going to give it to us. You have to find and search and implement, you know, and we're part of, we want to be a part of the lighthouse that's, that's standing up and going here. Here's some ways you can heal yourself. You don't have to wait and, and, if you get a sentence of something like cancer or fibromyalgia, or even I wonder, um, cause we do have cases of long COVID of people really, really being ill. Yeah. Yeah. Actually I want to, I shouldn't have, I shouldn't have skipped that, but yeah. anybody that has had the vaccination or COVID has spike proteins, right? Those spike proteins are problematic for your heart, your respiratory system, your lungs, everything. Uh, we have the answer to that. Eon X39 and glutathione, our glutathione patch is amazing. Um, those three will knock out spike proteins. I'm not allowed to say any medical claims, but I can just tell you from experience, from friends that have done it and done this live blood cell studies and then shown in six weeks time, all of the spike proteins are gone because glutathione is your body's master antioxidant. And when you couple the, these three together, they have the most amazing, I mean, the people that live the longest in the world have the highest levels of glutathione. And so I was actually on glutathione before I learned about the patches. I was getting it via IV or Thank orally. You. Well, guess what? When you get an IV of glutathione, you raise your glutathione levels uh, 27% for seven minutes. When you are wearing a patch, it increases 300% and it stays there for 24 hours. And so for people who've never heard of glutathione, this is the most amazing, it's your primary antioxidant for detoxification. And we all live in a very toxic space so the, from the, the air we breathe to the water we drink. And it's, but it's your immune booster. It's your body's master antioxidant. Uh, so it protects DNA uh, from damage. It actually initiates repair to damaged cells. Um, it improves hearing and eyesight. It, it is, uh, it's very good for the skin. It's not only very good for acne, but it's very good for imperfections to the skin. Oh, and it regrows and regenerates cartilage. So we have people uh, who have bone on bone knees, who wear an Aeon and a glutathione on their knee. And in, in months, they go back and they don't need their they don't need their knee replacement anymore. They've got new cartilage that's grown in there. It's 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 also protective. We talked a little bit about people with Parkinson's. Um, it helps protect the myelin sheath. Well, if you know anything about the myelin sheath, that's huge, and that actually has people have seen reversal of symptoms um, when they do that. It it helps to detox the brain uh, from heavy metals. But the big thing I wanted to talk about briefly was just it gets rid of those spike proteins. You got to get rid of those spike proteins if you have them, because they're just going to cause this long damage. And it may be now, and it may be two years from now, but it, they're they're not good. They're misshaped cells. They're they're clumpy and they're sticky, and they're not oxygenating properly. So it's really important. Okay, so clarification: spike proteins don't go away once you have them. These 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 will make it go away. These will go away, Jenny. Well, yes, I, I meant like without the patches. Are without the patches, protein? right? No, there are, and there, there are very few protocols that can actually knock them out. There are some, but they're, you know, I'm not a big fan of pharmaceuticals. I'm, and, and unfortunately, most of our doctors, and I, and I'm not knocking doctors. I mean, they have a place, but they're trained in schools, uh, where they literally, the curriculum is built by pharmaceutical companies. So they come out, they know how to operate and they know what drugs to use. But there are times when there are things like this where your own body is so wise and we can tap into its own wisdom and elevate our own levels to natural homeostasis, the proper balance. It's not too much, it's not too little. You have low blood pressure, it's gonna make it higher. You have high blood pressure, it's gonna make it lower. All of the right balance, that homeostasis is so critical. There's a wisdom in our bodies and this helps to tap into that in a way that I don't think drugs do. There's always a problem with drugs somewhere. It's like, it's like it does this, but it, but it does that. Right. Oh, well, I mean, I love the commercials, right? Where yes. it's a 30 oh, second commercial yeah. and they and give you, <laughs> well, and then they have like the 20 seconds of all the benefits and then 10 seconds of 10 to 20 symptoms and side effects and contraindications and risks. If you take that just for that one thing, and just don't know what's really going to happen because they can't guarantee it. 
that's basically yeah. the the irony about pharmaceuticals, right? I mean, and then oh, exactly. one last thing: if you're on any type of antidepressant, I know it's not something you're putting in your body. Is it still something that they can try? And then just a caveat: uh, on YouTube, you can see Darlene holding up this tiny patch. Is what maybe like less than an inch width? It's tiny little itty bitty white thing, right? Yeah. So I wanted like our audio board. people to hear it. It's really small. Yeah. It's like really quarter. the size of a quarter. And it can be anywhere on your body. It can even be on the outside of your clothing, like outside of a sweatshirt or a sweater. It doesn't actually have to be sticking to your skin. My friend who has the daughter with a rare genetic disorder or kids with autism, they have sensory issues sometimes. So it doesn't have to touch their skin. Um, and speaking of the drugs you were talking about, the same friend that introduced me to the patch, her cousin is a, a, an agent orange veteran and had end stage leukemia, Jenny. And this cousin of hers was basically being handed a drug and said, this drug is going to kill you, but it's going to improve your quality of life until you die. And she said, cousin, Robert, please do not do that. So he did the patches instead. And guess what? In two days, he was off his pain meds and out of bed. And in two weeks, he was traveling to USS Arizona and doing a bucket list trip with his, with her dad to see USS Arizona in Pearl Harbor and, and stood in line and did this tour for six hours, two days in a row with no walker and no wheelchair. He has since donated his walker and his wheelchair. And he has, um, his white cell count has continued to drop and he's living a very high quality of life. Instead of taking the pill that was going to kill him, that was the only option Western medicine had for him. So just have hope and, and look for alternatives because if I would not have, we would not, I would not have my husband, his personality, his, we would, we would not be where we are today. Um, he would be sleeping through the whole day and, uh, we, I would have just basically been going and checking in with the Alzheimer's clinic every year to see how far he had declined. What? Because the only, even the only medicine they have for him uh, causes brain bleeds in 50% of people with APOE 4.4, not an option for him. So it, it, it really, this is a safe, wonderful approach. Um, there's nobody that, it, there's only one person that should be careful and work with their doctor. That's someone who has an organ transplant. If you have an organ from someone else's body in your body, because this is going to boost your immune system so much. And some, some, you know, they're typically on an immune suppressant drug to keep their own body's immune system from getting too high. So those people should consult with their doctor. Um, anybody can consult with your doctor. I consulted with my doctor. She's like, yeah, I use the patches. I think they're great. I'm like, why didn't you tell me about them? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I was a little annoyed. I was a little annoyed. <laughs> <laughs> well, again, because they're trained in what they're okay. allowed to deliver. And they don't right? want to get in trouble. Yeah. And they also don't want to be sued or written up, you know. And yeah. so it, it 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 falls on us to spread the word as quickly and as much as possible, really truly. So folks, we I I, I will get in trouble from my podcast producer. Sorry, Kay and friends. Uh, I had to cut this commercial off now, even though I think Darlene and I could go on for another hour. Please, please make sure you like, follow and subscribe so you don't miss when Darlene comes back. Go to her uh, website. Again, what is it, Darlene? I am reverseaging.com. I just wanted her to say because <laughs> her voice is nice. <laughs> <laughs> so go there, go to danceandheal.com and then let us know how you like the patches. Okay. They're teeny tiny. They don't have to go on your skin. They can go on your clothing and we will see you again next time. Bye-bye. Thanks for listening to Dance to Heal with Jenny C. Cohen. Come back next time to hear stories of recovery through movement and learn more ways that you can move your body. To work with me and continue your journey, visit outsideinrecovery.com. Are you ready to move?